Though it seems like it has been a long time ago that the Superior General, Father Louis Logan, opened and convoked the 37th General Chapter, now we are within days of its beginning. Chapters are always beautiful and grace-filled moments in the life of a congregation. But especially for us oblates, they are a chance to animate and energize ourselves as we look forward to the future. This year we are also excited about two new things in our chapter. The first one is a change in venue. This year we are going to the Centro Agentes in Nemi, Italy. It's a wonderful and beautiful location overlooking the lake. Very picturesque. I'm sure that the delegates will find it a beautiful and wonderful place in which to have the chapter. And secondly, and perhaps most importantly, we have decided that it is going to be a paperless chapter. That is to say that we will reduce our dependence on paper as much as possible. All of the capitulars will be issued these tablets on which they are to do their work. There in those tablets, they will find information, they will find schedules, they will find documents, they will be able to edit, they will be able to work on those tablets, saving energy and saving paper along the way. As in chapters before, we will look to the past, we will look at the decisions, we will look at the proposals, we would look at the directions that were issued by the last chapters and see how well we've done, how we have advanced those proposals. Then we also will look at the present, the five regions of our Oblate congregation will give reports on their regions and they will talk about their successes, their challenges, their opportunities. And then we will look at the future what will be the directions that we will take for the next six years. I would like to thank the central government, the pre-capitular committee, the various committees and individuals their boundless energy that have led us to this point. And I thank them for their work and we continue to work as we prepare for September the 14th. At the same time, we implore the Holy Spirit that the Holy Spirit will come to guide, to energize and to enlighten and strengthen those gathered for chapter and we call upon the intercession of Mary Immaculate and St. Eugene as we conclude all our preparations for the 37th General Chapter, that our month-long gathering may be a time of conversion and of reflection. Furthermore, we invite you to join us in chapter through our webpage, OMI World, and look for information, 
for videos and updates that will keep you informed as to what is happening during our month-long chapter. As our theme says, we continue the journey as pilgrims in hope and in communion. Thank you.